complement system. It is one of the important system of the innate immune system. So, complement proteins, it is comprised of the basically the complement proteins. Complement system is comprised on the complement proteins. Complement proteins kya cheez hain? Yeh aisi proteins hain jo ke blood mein, serum mein ya plasma mein maujood hain. And the one of the important characteristics of these proteins, they are heat labile. Means agar serum ya plasma ko 56 degree centigrade pe 30 minutes ke liye rakha jaye, to yeh complement proteins inactivate ho jati hain. That is one of the important characteristics. In ki nature hai, in ki property hai. And another important feature that these protein causes the lysis of the bacterial cells. Most of the time, because this is an immune system, so invading agent, which bacteria hai, unki killing karti. Lekin sometimes in abnormal condition, they will also cause the killing of the self or jo body ke apne cells hai, jaise red blood cells ya white blood cells, unki killing bhi cause kar sakte. Okay. These proteins, they are being present in an inactive form, which are called as proenzymes. Means proenzymes mean that these enzymes are being present in inactive or zymogen form. Matlab, ye serum may inactive form may hai, lekin jab condition aegi, jab ko infectious state aegi, to these proteins will get activated. Or ye proteins activate kaise hongi? Ye proteins activate hogi by a process, by a reaction which is called as cascading reaction. Cascading reaction ka matlab ye hai. If there are 20 proteins of complement from C1 to C20, to C1 proteins jab bacteria ya infectious agent se activate hogi, to uske kuch residues banenge aur wo jo residues banenge, wo hi residues next protein that is complement protein 2 or complement protein 3 unko activate karenge. So you can say that ye ek chain reaction hai. That is also called as cascade reaction. Ab, is cascade reaction ka fayda kya hai? Ke agar is cascade reaction mein koi protein missing hai, to it will not carry on. Aur wo process wahi stop ho jayega. So, that is very important attribute of the complement protein. So, the function of the complement protein is very important. That is opsonization. Opsonization, जैसे मैंने आपको पहले बताया है कि ये एक ऐसा प्रोसेस है जिसकी वजह से फेगोसाइटोसिस का प्रोसेस इनहेंस हो जाता है या इंक्रीज कर जाता है। अब कॉम्प्लीमेंट प्रोटीन्स क्योंकि ऑप्शनाइजेशन के प्रोसेस को इंक्रीज या इनहेंस करती हैं, तो डेट्स वाइ इट एक्ट्स एस एन ऑप्शनिन। ऑप्शनिन मींस दोस the complement proteins are also considered as very good chemoattractant. Means these causes the movement of the phagocytes from blood towards the site of infection, like neutrophils. That's why these are considered as an, an a chemoattractant. And another important function of the complement protein that they are pro-inflammatory. Means that causes the inflammatory process. Inflammatory process kya hai? Jo ke tissue response hai against infection. Means host mein jab inflammatory process initiate hoga, to iska matlab hai ke jo invading agent hai, jo infectious agent hai, un ki killing, un ki against defense provide kiya jayega. To yehi complement proteins, they are pro-inflammatory. Yeh inflammatory process ko Enhance karengi jis ki wajah se immune system will boost up. Okay, next the complement activation. Jaisi mainne aapko bataya ki complement proteins they are present in inactive form. So every time whenever there will be the need of activation of the complement protein, to unki activation required hai. Or us activation ke process ko hum kehte hai complement activation process. Ab ye complement activation kaise hogi? There are three important pathways. The first one is the classical pathway. The second one is alternate pathway. And the very important third one is lectin pathway. Ye tino different pathways hai, jo ke complement proteins, jo inactive form mein hai, un ki activation karengi, or as a result, jo active molecules hai, wo produce honge. 
here you can see that the snapshot of all these pathways the first one is classical pathway ye classical pathway is ka other name hai that is antibody dependent ye antibody ki maujoodgi mein jab bacteria ki surface pe antibody aake lagegi to tab hi classical pathway activate hoga then there is an, an lectin pathway and alternate pathway lectin and alternate pathway they don't need antibody that's why they are antibody independent pathway ab ye antibody ki gair maujoodgi mein लेक्टिन और अल्टरनेट पाथवे एक्टिवेट होंगे और आफ्टरवर्ड यू कैन सी डेट ये तीनों पाथवे मर्ज करेंगे एक प्रोसेस में डेट इज द एक्टिवेशन ऑफ कॉम्प्लीमेंट प्रोटीन थ्री एंड जनरेशन ऑफ सी फाइव कन्वर्टेज जब सी थ्री बन जाएगा और वो इन नेक्स्ट फेज में वो एक्टिवेशन करेगा फिफ्थ प्रोटीन डेट इज सी फाइव और उसके बाद फाइनली एक कॉम्प्लेक्स बनेगा डेट वुड बी कॉल्ड एज द लिटिक कॉम्प्लेक्स और मेम्ब्रेन अटैक कॉम्प्लेक्स और उस पाथवे को हम लिटिक और अटैक पाथवे कहते हैं तो यू कैन सी डेट ये तीनों पाथवे मर्ज करेंगे एक कॉमन पाथवे में और उस कॉमन पाथवे की नतीजे में एक लिटिक पाथवे डेवलप होगा और अल्टीमेटली इट विल कॉजेस द लाइसिस ऑफ द फॉरेन पार्टिकल लाइक बैक्टीरिया और एक इम्यून रिस्पॉन्स जनरेट होगा